My father was a drinker and a fiend. That's really sad, man. You gotta be having some negative thoughts about that. You don't listen, do you? You just ask the same questions. Are you having any negative thoughts? All I have are negative thoughts. Okay. Sure. Sure. Hello daydreamers, welcome to Small Town Creative, a channel devoted to helping you survive and thrive in your journey as an independent artist. I'm Michael Masters, a Michigan-based graphic designer and illustrator. Our guest today has been called the Clown Prince of Crime, the Jester of Genocide, and the Harlequin of Hate. After a short stint as a stand-up comedian, this guy decided that his form of artistic expression was to incite chaos and fear in the minds of those in his town of Gotham City. He's on the phone with us now. Now, hello, Arthur, or should I call you Jack? Jack is dead, my friend. Can you introduce me as Joker? Joker, you just introduced yourself. You're live at this very moment. Is there anything you want to say to your fans? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We are tonight's entertainment. If there's one thing we know about you, it's that you are quite the entertainer. Yes! Another stunning Joker entrance! <laughs> Hey, just so you know, uh, during our talk, I'm going to be doing a speed art illustration of you to keep things interesting. Such an honor, I'm speechless. <laughs> I'm glad you thought so. I was afraid it might give you some negative thoughts. You are not someone that I want to offend. <laughs> I, I don't want to kill you. What would I do without you? You complete me. Well, that's very kind of you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So, Joker, we just got a question in from Wonder Woman who wants to know, was there somebody that inspired you to get into comedy? Mm -hmm. My mother always tells me to smile and put on a happy face. She told me I had a purpose to bring laughter and joy to the world. Was it then that you decided to take the stage for the first time? Mm -hmm. Was comedy always your chosen outlet for creative expression? When I was a little boy and told people I was going to be a comedian, everyone laughed at me. Oh, that must have given you some negative thoughts. Mm -hmm. But you're not doing comedy anymore? Well, no one's laughing now. I guess it would make sense that you would want to do something different. Speaking of, this new art form you're calling Paint the Town Mad, how's that going for you? Oh, how delicious it is! This town needs an enema. I couldn't agree more. We talked briefly about your mother, what about your father? What was he like? My father was a drinker and a fiend. And one night, he goes off crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen knife to defend herself. Wow. He doesn't like that. He comes at me with the knife. Why so serious? He sticks the blade in my mouth. Let's put a smile on that face. And... Why so serious? Whoa, that's really sad, man. I mean, you gotta be having some negative thoughts about that. You don't listen, do you? You just ask the same questions. How's your job? Are you having any negative thoughts? All I have are negative thoughts. Okay, sure, sure. Oh look, we've got another call coming in from Superman. Hello, Superman? Hello, Michael. Joker. <gasps> Look, Spoony. Batsy decided to leave little boy Blue to watch the house while he's away. I don't have the time or energy for your games, Joker. Oh, what's the matter, Soupy? No steam left in the old locomotive? Okay, guys, let's not get too riled up. So, Superman, did you have a question? Yes. Uh, Joker, it sounds like during your new reign of terror, you've been thinking about taking on new employees. Is your business ready for an upgrade like that? Our operation is small, but there's a lot of potential for aggressive expansion. So which of you fine gentlemen would like to join our team? Oh, I'm good. Uh, Superman? I'll have to discuss it with Lois. I mean, uh, never mind. I gotta go. What happened? Did your, your balls drop off? Hmm? Okay. So, Joker, let's talk about your art. Do you have a specific medium that you prefer for your style of painting? You see, I'm a guy of simple taste. I enjoy uh, dynamite and gunpowder and gasoline. Do you realize how dangerous of a combination these things are? Whatever doesn't kill you simply makes you... Stronger. 
stranger. Interesting logic, but I'm not sure that your safety is anything to joke about, but hey, if it works for you. Ooh, a joke a day keeps the gloom away. As you know, my channel is devoted to helping independent artists thrive. Do you have any advice for some of our aspiring artists listening out there? If you're good at something, never do it for free. I could not agree more. Well, friends, there you go. Thank you so much for joining us today, Joker. The game's up, Penguin. Head for the game. <laughs> if you like this video, please click the thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't yet. See you next time. <laughs> <laughs>